Hi guys, guess what I have? I have a very special box opening today, or I guess I could call it a package opening. And this one came all the way from Russia. Look at these cool stamps. I thought the stamps were just so pretty. But anyway, I've got the uh, addresses hidden so that we can keep those private, but I just thought I would share really quick these cute, or pretty stamps, not cute, <laughs> they're pretty, pretty stamps. And, um, oops, bumping my tripod again. But do you guys know any uh, BJD sculptors or artists from Russia or who this could be? There's something I've been wanting for my boys, and I found this company, and it is, well, if you've, if you've seen the title, you already know, but this is, uh, I think it's pronounced Waloya, Waloya, maybe it's Waloya, Waloya Mooring, and they have the most precious little animals. This Waloya Mooring. I hope I'm saying that right. I apologize if I'm pronouncing it wrong. But oh, it's wrapped really good. Let's see if we can get into it. <clears throat> so I have been eyeing their little red foxes for the longest time. And that's exactly what I wanted. And this is a um, red fox cub, like a pup. Waloya Mooring Dolls and Art. That's such a pretty box. And purple is my favorite color. <gasps> favorite color. And that's so beautiful. Look at these silhouettes. I love silhouettes. You guys ready? I'm so excited. Okay. Let's see what we got. Oh, he's still wrapped up in there. Waloya Mooring. This is the fox cub. Red fox, full set. Gosh, I'm so excited, guys. Ooh. Oh my gosh, there he is. He's so cute. He came with two heads because um, one is like a sleeping head and the other one is the open eyes. Let's make sure that's everything. Let me see what else we got in here. So he's one of these cubs. 3D printed BJD and MJD animals and fantastic creatures. Oh, they're so cute. Oh my gosh, I've always loved red foxes anyway. Oh, they're so beautiful. Bone forest gifts. What's this? Oh. oh I'll have to check out that website. You guys can know also um, 3D printed jewelry. Oh, wow, that's interesting. So guys, go check out boneforestgifts.com and I guess they're also boneforestgifts on Instagram. So that's jewelry, it says. And here's the uh, owner's manual. Very nice, very awesome. Let's Now let's check him out. <gasps> oh my gosh, he's so cute. He's gonna be, I can't remember. Oh my gosh, guys, did it say on the uh, card? What size he is seven centimeters and I don't know if they carry the seven centimeters anymore I didn't see a seven centimeter one on their website but um, yeah so but this one is supposed to be seven centimeters and he's the cub oh, he's so cute oh look at him oh my gosh he is a, like the most precious thing ever Oh, I can't wait to show him to my guys. 
I think they're going to find him somewhere. They're going to find him. Wow, I'm afraid to like... Wow, look at that. The tail has like got all these joints. He's very lightweight. He's very lightweight. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure what he's made out of. What did it say? I, you know, I'm... I don't want to say the wrong thing, so I'm not going to say anything, but he's very lightweight. I don't want to break him. He feels so fragile. So precious. Look at that little feet move and everything. And I'm not going to even attempt to change his head right now because I am not sure how to do that. Set him down and take a look at his other face. I might bring a couple of my other BJDs over here. I should have thought of that before I started the video. Just to kind of show you the size compared to his size. Oh, look at him. He's so beautiful. So beautiful. Oh, it's a magnet. Is it? So I think you can just change the face by pulling it off, I do believe, because it looks like it's just a magnet. Okay, that's good to know. Let's try it. I don't want to break him on camera, but I'm going to just uh, see what happens. Let's see if we can just take his face off. Oh, <laughs> that scared me. Yep, so it is a magnet. Oh, very cool. Oh, cute. Let's try his other face on. Whoop. Beep. There he is. Oh, cutesy. Cutesy, cutesy. Look at that. Let's put his tail up. He's a happy pup. Very cute. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. So happy. I'll have to make my guys go exploring and like they'll find him out in the wilderness and take him in, make him their pet. So let's see what size, hang on guys, I'm gonna lay him down like this. <laughs> Sorry, let me grab, uh, I'm gonna grab an SD and I'm gonna grab, uh, let's see who should I grab? I don't wanna take too long. Let me grab an MSD and an SD, and we can see what they look like with him. Hold on just a minute, guys. Let's try Sebastian. He will be, he will be a very tiny puppy compared to Sebastian. Look here. Okay, that will be a, whoa! Okay. <laughs> ah. Oh my gosh, guys, hold on. Should have been more prepared. <laughs> so, oh my gosh. Yee. At least he can hold him and he would look like a tiny puppy, a baby pup. Let's. Let me show you how he'll look with Sebastian. He could hold him on his lap. Let's do it like, let's kind of do it like this. Hold on. Too bad. Don't mind the clutter behind us. I wasn't actually going to show the rest of the house, but I've got my face up supplies back there and more heads in a box over here. <laughs> but uh, there he is with Sebastian, and Sebastian is my SD boy, one of my smaller SD boys. What do you, whoops, what do you think, guys? 
Not too bad. He makes a cute little puppy. Okay, let me put you back on the tripod and go grab... Let me go grab Felix. He's my MSD, my first MSD boy. And let's see what he looks like with him. He's going to look much bigger with Felix. Here is, here's Felix. So, oh, he looks precious with Felix. Oh my goodness, I love that. So he could work with either of them, I think. I'll just need to decide because I'm kind of splitting up their stories and doing my MSDs and SDs a little more separately in photos now. Just because my MSDs look so tiny next to my SDs and I don't really want them to be little kids. Oopsie. Felix is so kicky. He's falling, coming apart there. Okay. So let's take a look at them again. I don't know. He looks really cool with Felix with that size. But like I said, he could go either way. I mean, when he's down on the floor, like when they're standing, he's, he's about, oh, oh, I'm sorry, Felix. He's <laughs> falling down. He's about the size of Sebastian's foot. Look at that. So that's how tiny he is, guys. Yay, but I'm so happy to have him. And I think I'm going to go ahead and sign off. I don't know who he's going to show up with on Instagram. It'll just depend. Ugh. Come on, guys. Whoa. And there's Felix and Sebastian together. So if you're ever curious about the size differences with um, SDs and MSDs, there you have it. And this little guy, like I said, he's seven centimeters. I think they've got ones even smaller than him available. And the adult fox, I think the adult fox is about that size. So, yes, so precious. All right, guys, thanks for joining. I'm going to go ahead and sign off, and I will see you guys again next time. Find a good angle to end on. <laughs> All right, bye, guys.